The death of a Nevada man found pinned under a car may be the first death connected to one of the powerful earthquakes that struck Ridgecrest, California last week. Troy Ray, Ray was found dead in Pahrump. That's about 200 miles northeast of Ridgecrest, California. 8 News Now reporter Shakela Alvarenga went to Pahrump today to learn more about him. 56-year-old Troy Ray lived off the grid, and that's the way he liked it. At his rural property in Pahrump, he worked on his car, far away from the hustle and bustle of the city. And he taught me a lot of things about what I know with cars nowadays and stuff like that. And uh, he just was, uh, that's all I can say, he was a hardworking man, best father and son can ask for. Today, Orion Ray and his stepbrother came to collect Troy's belongings. Troy was a father of three and a lover of the outdoors. Accidents happened. He was at the wrong place at the wrong time, and uh, and uh, I don't know really. I, I didn't really. I, don't, I my mind couldn't process it at first. I was just unbelievable that my father passed. Police say Troy was working underneath his red Jeep when it fell off its jacks and onto him during the July 4th earthquake. His body was found Tuesday afternoon outside of his home. We all miss him very much already, and it's just hard. It's just rough right now for us. A 6.4 magnitude earthquake struck near Ridgecrest, California on July 4th around 1030 in the morning. A second earthquake hit the area on July 5th. Parts of southern Nevada, including Pahrump, felt the impact. He helped me out a lot in those 26 years that I've been alive. And, uh, you know, it's just, just sad how he died. And he liked to do, he went out doing what he liked to do. Shakela Alvarenga, 8 News Now. The Nye County Sheriff's Office say they plan to release more information about Ray's death tomorrow.